building material options play a significant role in determining the sustainability of a structure. Environment-friendly elements are those produced and employed in ways that minimize their ecological impact. Selecting greener substances is an important aspect of eco-conscious construction. They can be made from renewable resources, recycled materials, or waste products. Using materials that are available locally is another way to promote environmental sustainability. This not only saves money but also reduces the energy needed and pollution produced. Environmentally friendly materials, often referred to as green building materials, are those used in construction that have undergone processes with minimal environmental impact during their production, installation and maintenance phases. These materials should possess certain characteristics such as durability, reusability or recyclability. Additionally, they should incorporate recycled components in their composition and originate from local resources, making them regionally sourced materials. The importance of sustainable building materials is undeniable, especially in the face of rising global temperatures and the growing impact of climate change. To address these challenges, adopting sustainable construction practices has become essential. Sustainable construction materials play a crucial role in reducing the environmental impact of construction projects. They affect everything from the resources used in their production to the energy required for transportation and installation. Choosing sustainable materials is a proactive way to minimize these environmental effects and create eco-friendly structures. The traditional materials used in construction, such as concrete and steel, have substantial environmental impacts. There are a number of novel sustainable building materials that are being developed and used. These materials include biomass-based materials which are made from renewable resources, such as wood, straw and agricultural waste recycled materials which materials are made from waste products such as plastic bottles and tires natural materials materials are extracted from the earth such as stone clay and sand advanced materials that have unique properties that make them well suited for use in buildings such as self-cleaning materials and energy absorbing materials some of the most novel sustainable building materials are bamboo, recycled wood, rammed earth, cork, straw bales, hempcrete. These novel sustainable building materials offer a variety of potential benefits, including reduced environmental impact. These materials can help to reduce the environmental impact of buildings by using less energy and resources, improve performance, these materials can improve the performance of buildings in terms of energy efficiency, durability, and comfort. Increased innovation. The development of novel sustainable building materials can help to drive innovation in the construction industry. There are many types of sustainable construction materials, often referred to as green building products. Lumber, stone, Metal and paper are materials that can be recycled and reused as building products. Bamboo, cork, straw and even coconut are examples of construction products that can be renewed quickly. The waste management hierarchy is as follows. Reduce, reuse, recycle, dispose. The waste hierarchy tells us that the best way to deal with waste is to stop it from happening in the first place reduce. But if there's already waste, they should know that throwing it away is the worst choice for the environment. Instead, they should aim to use things again and then recycle them. The aim of the waste management hierarchy is to achieve optimal environmental outcomes and is accepted nationally and internationally as a guide for prioritizing waste management practices. The waste management hierarchy was established by the Environmental Protection Agency 
EPA, as a guide for prioritizing waste management practices in line with the smallest environmental impact. Construction waste is the waste generated from the construction, renovation, and demolition of buildings and infrastructure. It is a major environmental problem, as it contributes to pollution, greenhouse gas emissions, and the depletion of natural resources. This waste includes materials such as concrete, wood, metal, plastic, and glass. Activities at construction sites can result in the discharge of polluted water that detrimentally affects local water courses or the marine or potential health impacts. The escape of litter from the site, or excavation or importation of unsuitable fill materials. Waste management in construction activities has been promoted with the aim of protecting the environment in line with the recognition that waste from construction works contributes significantly to environmental pollution. Various approaches to construction waste management have been developed in research work and in existing practices. These can be broadly grouped into three areas namely Waste classification Waste management strategies Waste disposal technologies 